Welcome to Cinema Vision, to the 3D movie world. Cinema Vision would like to present a 3D film set and the method of its installation. The Cinema Vision set contains mirror rig, dovetail main mounting plate with a set of screws, mat box insertings, top French flag, side French flags, and two camera mounting plates. To properly compose the CinemaVision 3D set, in the first place, mount double VLOG battery power supply board on the main mounting plate. Place camera communication cable Gig E on the main mounting plate. This cable and the bottom camera power cable should be placed precisely and held with a screw clamp, which we will use later to mount ambient locket device. We screw the main mounting plate with the rig by using three brass screws and a flat plate screwdriver. The cables can be hooked for a while so not to interfere. Now the rig is ready to be put on the tripod and to be leveled. Our 3D set will consist of two Red Epic Mysterium X cameras and two identical lenses, 25mm focal length Cook Mini S4i. In addition, we will need two easy top wooden camera plates with a set of screws and brackets, which we'll use later to mount a follow focus device. Tools we need are flat blade screwdriver, standard red Allen key and a small Torx key. We have to prepare also two CinemaVision camera mounting plates. First, we have to replace the camera's radiator covers with the easy top plates. The next stage is to mount CinemaVision camera mounting plates on both cameras. Then, to the upper right edge of the cameras, tighten the motor holders of the follow focus unit. Now, the cameras are ready to be fitted with lenses. It is worth remembering that the lenses 
should be always assigned to a particular camera, left to left and right to right, and to install them always in the same way. This will facilitate the subsequent set synchronization. Before mounting the cameras on the rig, slip the insertings into the mat box. The left camera should be mounted on the upper, horizontal trolley Everything we've done with them is forgiven. and the right on the vertical, bottom trolley. The next step is inserting the batteries to power the set and mounting screens for the cameras. The screens can be screwed to the mounting holes on the rig's upper crossbar. The screen mounted on the left side, has to be connected to the upper, left camera. And the one mounted on the right, to the bottom, right camera. To connect ambient locket device will be needed. Two 3 BNC red sync cables, two LTC out cables, Configured ambient locket with a mounting screw, two BNC double female connectors, T-shaped BNC signal splitter and 2.5mm Allen key. Green tips of the BNC sync cable responsible for a GAN lock signal should be joined with a T-shaped BNC connector. Connect LTC out cables with the yellow mark tips using BNC double female connectors. Other white tips are useful when using an external trigger. Connect LEMO plugs of LTC out cables and Genlock BNC connector to the appropriate sockets of the ambient locket. Screw the ambient connector to the previously mounted bracket. At this stage, appropriate cables can be connected to the cameras. Sync cable from the locket device, Gig E communication cable, and power. We perform the same for the bottom camera. Our 3D set is equipped with the Follow Focus Aladdin Mark II device. It consists of four servo motors to control lenses, five motor cables, Aladdin Mark II control device, magic arm coupler, power cable, an additional motor to control the interaction, and two mounting rods. Servos to control iris and focus mount on both lenses using rods. Next, 
install an additional servo motor to control the interaction of the 3D set. Using a magic arm coupler, attach to the rig's body the Aladdin Mark II follow focus control device. Connect the power supply to the socket on the battery plate. Plug lens motor control cables into the appropriate sockets of the Aladdin driver. At the end, plug the cable to the servo controlling the interaction of the 3D set. Wiring should be arranged carefully so not to interfere during the later work with the camera. Now, the 3D Cinema Vision set is ready to be synchronized.